Hey guys, so Kanye West getting crazier and crazier with every move. Now he replaced his teeth with titanium dentures. And uh, I like this guy in terms of his music. Like He's an incredible rapper. He changed uh, rap music a lot and made so many great songs. I can't even count because it's impossible to count them. I really love his music. And it sucks to see this guy actually struggling like that. I'm sure he has some psychiatric struggles. I'm like, uh, all of his moves are so, so crazy and weird. And some people can say, oh, it's normal. Like, he removed all of his teeth and replaced them with titanic dentures. It's, it's pretty normal. Why would you say something like that? I would say it's not normal. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> I mean, you can do whatever you want, but replace, like, Take off all of your teeth. It's first, first of all, it's extremely painful procedure. I don't care how much you pay in your doctor, but it's extremely painful. And Kanye did, did that, and like, I mean, he feels that that's fine. I know that sometimes he's this type of guy, you know, he wants to be the center of attention at all costs, and he makes his wife actually dress up like crazy outfits, almost naked all the times, on different red carpet events, and makes people talk about him and probably he feels that that it's a good way uh, but uh, his moves are actually crazy and now this reports that been saying that he actually treats her wife like a slave in some way because she may she does whatever he makes her to do and she dresses like crazy outfits and whatever because he wants her to dress up like that and also he wants to make her new Kim Kardashian and before, some people were saying, oh, this situation, Kanye is not gonna do that. And a lot of people defended him because they love his music, they love his talent, he's an incredible talent, no questions asked, no doubts about it. He's incredible once-in-a-generation talent, but his moves are crazy. He got crazier and crazier. And, you know, uh, all these psychologists, they say, like, with the age, our mental issues that were in our childhood, like, it's a little with the age they're getting uh, heavier and heavier that's why probably Kanye does what he does so let's see what his doctor actually said so his doctor Thomas Connolly in Beverly Hills says yeah it was a pleasure to work with every step of the process his vision for designing unique art transcends dental progression the marriage of his vision with dental science has created a new look that is epic I don't know how it epic I mean it looks disgusting to me I don't understand Maybe some people like it. I want to know actually what do you think in the comment section. If you have anything to say, share your opinion. Like say, oh, I actually like what Kanye did like to himself. Like this crazy grills. It's not even grills. He just replaced his teeth, and it's not uh, okay. I mean, like <laughs> same like next move probably he might replace his hand with like plastic hand or whatever. Who knows? Like it's the same thing. It's disgusting. Like I can imagine myself doing something like that, some procedure like that, and like. Oh, you can say like, oh, you're judgmental, don't say this stuff about Kanye, he's a genius, whatever. I mean, all genius is a little bit crazy. It's proven in the history books. Article says that his earlier claims to have replaced his teeth were met with skepticism, with Kanye's fans doubting that even he would do such a thing. And it says West was dropped by Adidas Gap and Balenciaga after he went on a series of anti-Semitic rants in October 2022. It was like a sign, I mean, it was a bell that Kanye is not fine, he's not okay. Even though, I understand, like, some people hate white people, some people hate black people for no reason, right? Some people hate Jews. It's the way, it's the world we live in, unfortunately. And I know, like, a lot of, uh, like, activists or... I mean, even government workers trying to to change that but I think it's just that you know when we all mixed up at the end of the day like it's gonna be no race at maybe in 50 years in 100 years from now maybe all these problems will go away but right now some people will have different opinion than the others so it was like a bow for me like I said like okay maybe he hate Jews maybe he hate Jewish people but um, of course, for Jewish people, it was like outrageous. They were like, oh my God, how can you say something like that? But it's like, you know, I just accept the things the, well, the way they are. So for me, it was like strange, but it wasn't like craziness. But for me, like all this stuff that he's taken over and over again, it's a sign of craziness. Also, the article says that it was uh, just officially revealed uh, that he owes more than $1 million in unpaid taxes. 
uh, it was discovered that his clothing firm Yeezy Apparel has had four active tax lines filled against it over the last three years for unpaid business tax totaling $934,000. Record shows he owes an additional $100,000 in property tax on two homes he owned with his ex-wife. I'm sure, like, it's sad to say because again and again and again I'm gonna tell you that I think Kanye is rap genius. He not only rap genius, you know, like he's fashion genius. He has an incredible vision. But he's gonna end up broke, in jail, or in mental facility. Unfortunately, I don't wanna see that happening. That's why probably I'm saying this. Maybe Kanye will hear that. And like, Kanye, you should uh, go to mental facility because like your actions are weird, extremely weird. I don't know if they're able to help him. Um, I'm not sure of that. I want to know what do you think. Leave me your thoughts in the comment section like always. And also share, like, subscribe. It helps this channel. See you in the next one. Bye.